what's up guys this is ronnie welcome back to our channel total technology so this is going to be the part 3 of base map tutorial so let me first uh, write this thing over here base map tutorial And let me just highlight this thing as a heading well uh, then let me just okay so uh, in this tutorial I'll be going to uh, talk about um, something new and something interesting so before uh, like moving forward so like on the new topic let me just uh, create one map like whatever we did in our last tutorial and uh, and after that I, I will i'll like uh, um, what you say i'm gonna talk about the new topic okay so but let me just uh, do the initial part like like importing of like libraries and uh, creating one simple map okay so first thing first like um, this is going to be like import map plot dot plot as plt import numpy as mp and next thing is base map right so anyone can guess what is going to be that thing pl underscore toolkits dot base map import Best map, right? Okay. No. Now let me just create one sample map of India, like map equals to okay map dot draw map boundaries coast lines this <laughs> one draw why this is not coming boundaries draw map boundaries let me check this thing first okay so we got our the the initial map and um, map dot draw map boundary I think yes if I don't put this thing let me just check this is a map boundary thing and inside that I have to just if I just map dot draw country yes most of the countries are done so just forget about that uh, let me just uh, create the Indian map over here so this is going to be best like last time we did base map and then this so ultimately this is going to be up to this okay so
thing well okay so lower left corner longitude will be something around 67 this is the lower left corner latitude probably 6 upper right probably 97 yes right and let me just keep it to 37 then project is going to be LCC thing let zero is 76 something and lng underscore zero 27 let me just okay okay i just this one missed it like zero well Lag zero the long zero is twenty seven. Now let me just draw this thing. Okay, no error. So hopefully if you just create map dot draw map boundary. map dot draw countries let's check it okay not sure what to happen over here like why this is like this uh, 67 6 97 37 mm, not sure like what is the problem here let me just make it a big fig dot plt dot figure and let's check it 10 by 10 what happened from argument must be level not integer what is the problem here plt dot figure sorry okay thing strange like not sure what is the problem here mm. Well, uh, let zero. Let's take it twenty seven. We did a mistake. Probably, I, I was I was doing the mistake over here. That is why let it let zero should be twenty seven, and this is like this. Now I think we got our map pretty well, and let's if I just make it a bit to the side. okay cool so we got the map now we have to just create the coastal lines map dot draw coast lines okay so this is our indian map so this is what we did last time right now uh, i'm coming back to today's topic like now this is our map but uh, if i ask you if or if, if someone is asked you could you please like draw the patches or like some some sort of lines to identify like states inside the map how you are going to do that like um, for example um, 
this part is going to be kerala this part is chennai this part is uh, bank karnataka here andhra pradesh this side will be uh, mumbai gujarat here the uh, mp and this side going to be uh, up then here punjab uh, srinagar jammu kashmir and this sides are going to be probably here bihar then bengal then this side odisha and the north states like uh, uh, other states like assam and all there but who is going to uh, like um, like draw that so you need to do you need, need to provide or need to create some sort of like uh, what you say like coordinates and you can do it but you have the coordinates like how to but the problem is that the states boundaries are not only about one single coordinate so it is the mixture of or it is the co combination of for example if you ask you to uh, just uh, draw this thing like uh, we have to provide some sort of bounding thing and after that it is created the map but if you see this in this bounding box these are the extra thing but if you do in inside the uh, like uh, states using this bounding box then the problem is that you probably might get some extra space so that extra space is from another state so boundaries will not be like prominent and uh, accurate so for that you need to uh, have some uh, like very accurate uh, lines or combinations of lines and um, there will be different sort of plots or like um, shapes for example this is one polygon shape this is one polygon shape the whole thing is one polygon shape this is one polygon shape so you need to um, provide something so for that uh, in, there is uh, like like by default there is no feature to draw any country's map from base map so for that there is a feature available within the base map but you need to like get those thing like from internet or from outside or from mostly the like government organization or the data organization so that is called shape file like uh, you have to download one shape file for indian state boundary so for any country you can do it like download free shape file so if you just uh, uh, just import that shape file inside your base map so it is going to uh, provide you the uh, like uh, lines with uh, like polygon patches with multiple like shapes to uh, like just to identify like how you can like uh, uh, create your uh, life map so i have already downloaded this uh, shape file from this website see this guy is asking me for uh, like some sort of like marketing thing so i'm not going for that so this is my shape file states and this is the actual shape file this thing so i'll be using uh, this uh, like this shape file okay so uh, uh, this is matplotly okay okay let me just uh, import another library call import save files as shp yes okay so this is done now uh, i'll be going to read that shape file for example uh, shape file equals to shp i think this is going to be redone only not sure uh, and the path will be like uh, states this tatef and the shape file will be admin2 dot shp i think shape let me check this thing first hmm the file shp hmm thing why the shape is not coming let me check this thing Mm -hmm. 
just give me some time thing okay i think this is the thing okay Let me just try this thing again. This is not working. Unable to open states admin 2.shp. Not sure what is the problem here. Mm. They are having some problem. Just give me some time. So, guys, so what we are doing, like um, just reading the save file, so it was throwing an error, unable to read the save file. So, let me just uh, uh, take the path of this thing. Probably, we need to go for the full path or like. Uh, um, it is inside this matplotlib, then base base map, and inside state. So the path will be like user running documents matplotlib statements. Okay, I think this should work now. Okay, so now shape file dot records. If you just check, so. It's having this many records okay so if you just go and check the length of this so I think this is going to be 36 yes okay so this is the actual shape file and to check the data inside the shape file you can use this thing but now from from matplotlib there is a different way of doing this thing like uh, map dot it's going to be draw shapes okay so we need to just uh, pass the save file like map dot read shape file okay shape file and again we have to pass the complete Path, I think, yes. Copy. Just try this thing first. Let's see whether this is working or not. Missing one, okay. There's one one parameter we need to pass. That's it. That is going to be admin2 the name of the shape file okay see the indian like uh, states boundaries are now created okay so i think i should make it a bit larger okay so this is our indian map all the state boundaries are now created so there are three things like uh, we have imported the shape file in a different way using save shape file uh, library and after that we just check how many states are there so if the shape file is correct like 36 just this is just overview like there are cases like many companies are having shape file but this is not properly fitted over here but just to just for a quick check i just mm, did this thing to check and after that i just uh, put this thing over here so guys uh, like uh, let me just this thing like um, like 
drawing states from shape file okay so this is like one thing like how to how to you uh, like how to download shape file how to like import shape file or how to read shape file all these things are covered in this tutorial so uh, let me just like uh, reading from shape file and updating the same okay so well uh, i think uh, this is uh, okay let me just check this thing once again so this is okay okay so i'm just keeping this open for probably five ten minutes more and after that we'll start the new thing so but meanwhile i'm just uh, uh keeping my 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 microphone on mute okay guys so just if someone is taking notes from this code because i'm not going to publish this code as of now in the github so probably there will be three four more videos and uh, like consolidated uh code will be published so if someone wants to take a note from this code can take it i'm just uh, keeping my mind mute for five ten minutes and after that i'll start the remaining part okay guys uh, so um, i think it's uh, done for this video uh, i think we have covered like uh, like very small thing but a very important things like uh, uh, how to like uh, load the safe file inside a base map and how to update the like existing map using the shape file so i think uh, you can uh, just take uh, uh, just take it as an some sort of homework or some sort of assignment like I'm not I'm not someone from any college so I'm just asking for homework so you just take it as a practice you can go ahead and download any like countries or states uh, shape file and just try to implement this thing and let's check what is happening and after that just you can do whatever you want to do okay guys so in the next video probably we're going to talk about more for example uh, this uh, shape files for example uh, let me just show you like shape file dot like think see uh, actually shape file is a combination of multiple shapes like this many shapes if you see uh, if i just lengthen this will be 36 total okay and this shape file is, is a combination of multiple points okay so if you just uh, just okay 
n for i in p print i dot okay i'm not sure what is happening over here mm. so file dot shapes uh, okay this Mm -hmm. I think something is happening. Let me just check what is happening. Uh, mm, okay, so if you see, th these are the different, like, uh, like what you say, like different coordinates for every shapes. Okay. So in this way you can uh, like understand like uh, like shape is a combination of points and point is like consolidatedly uh, uh, like creating shapes and shape is consolidatedly like creating one like combination of my uh, like one single shape file. So these are the points like and after that point is creating one shape and after that like uh, like all together all the shapes are creating one like uh, shape file. Okay. So this is a very important thing like uh, shape. Uh, points shape and points and this thing the the record like each record is uh, going to be uh, corresponding to uh, corresponding to a big uh, like each coordinates like these are the coordinates so, so there are three things like um, name of the state points shape or points and shape all together like you can say as a da, like geometric boundary or like geometric coordinates so one more thing like from the uh, beginning like we just import this thing after that we did, did this sort of like plotting and we did this shape file and we just uh, pass this thing like this is the name of every like shape file this is the name of the shape file like in my uh, thing like I can show you like this is my so every name is with admin2 so that is why the name is admin2 or the main shape file name is admin2.shape dot shape, dot shape file so I just give this thing and the remaining name should be this so this is done okay and after that if you just put the remaining things like coastal line and all so it's correct and this is quite uh, not related to base map but again this is very important to know how shape, uh, shape file actually works if you want to see the states and all you can just check by doing this thing so guys i think this is quite uh, like handful of information so i hope you guys enjoyed the uh, tutorial and definitely you guys will um, try to do something by your own and let me know i'm actually excited uh, to uh, understand or uh, like um, probably um, get some idea like how you guys are doing and if you guys are facing any issue just do let me move have facebook post or our youtube video comment or whatever you can send me direct email and um, the feedback like last week i got many feedbacks by email and our facebook page so guys keep doing it i'll probably try to create the tutorials on those topics no i'm not going to talk uh, about all these topics names i'm just uh, keep this secret because i got four or five topics but i just took one topic but i'm not gonna just close the name at this moment so other will be probably like they will feel like um they'll not feel happy right i i didn't choose their topic so nothing like that i'll be choosing all the topics but you know i'm also having some sort of time constraint so in future definitely i'll try to create all the tutorial on the given topics i'm just planning to uh like sort uh everything like as per the time window and my schedule so hopefully doing we'll be doing it and the last but not the least thing please subscribe to our channel those are not actually subscribe to our channel yet please hit the bell icon please subscribe to our channel so you should not miss any notification and also if possible if you think this video is will be helpful for someone from your friend or circle or from your family or anyone or any student just um, share our video with them as well so we can reach to the bigger audience and ultimately this will also motivate us okay guys so that's all for today hope to see you in the next video probably um, today evening or tomorrow i'm not sure this weekend you know so till then take care goodbye
section guys this is this is the uh, part 4 tutorial so while doing the upload i just seen that i have already created two three tutorials so for base map so initially i just said uh, while i just uh, shoot, uh, like recording the video that this is going to be part 3 so no this is going to be part 4 so i have just renamed it as base map tutorial part 4 so in the video when uh, like uh, if you see in the initial like face like the i think 90 percent cases you will see this name is actually not four not three so that was the mistake from my side because i have already created three tutorials so this should be four but i did uh, the mistake but i i change it now so in the at the end of the video but th there is no point but uh, if someone gets confused so for them it is easier to understand or make a reference so this is part four not part three but the whole video i just uh, like uh, I just said that uh, this is going to be part 3 and this is part 3 tutorial and the part 3 was uh, like um, in a bold blue color font was written so just ignore that this is part 4 in when I'll be doing upload uh, in um, I'll be doing the upload um, uh, uh, in YouTube that time also I'll be using this as a part 4 in the YouTube uh, video name so don't worry about that so guys this is a small mistake uh, take care bye uh, and hope to see you in, in the next video